So let's talk about this, bro. What's your obsession with woke comedy? It's just better comedy. You punch, you punch up, never down, never sideways. Just, you know, be intelligent, be woke. You think being woke is considered intelligence? Uh, yeah, of course. Hmm. And don't like people. Really? People see this is the problem. So what's Pe your definition of, of woke? Wait, but the problem is people are going for laughs per minute, or they're going for audience reaction. Well, what they should be going for is oh shit. Okay. You know, did I leave my impression, my mork, on them? You know what I mean? Did they leave better people? That's that's what comedy is about. A, that's a really that's a responsibility. That's hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. We of, are we are every comic. That should be the responsibility. We are now the preachers of the world because the preachers, those they're you know they're doing some bad stuff, mm. you know. And now comedians have the responsibility that the politicians, that the leaders aren't taking to say what's really happening. That's and if crazy. the people don't laugh, hey, at least they learned. At least they learned. At least they learned. I feel like if they don't laugh, at least nothing. Like, damn, I didn't do my fucking job. I couldn't read them. I did, my material sucked, apparently. Like, I could have communicated better. But you're saying if they don't laugh, at least they're better people for having heard what you said. I don't, I, I, as an artist, I don't go out there. Man, okay. As an artist, I don't go out there to be like, you know, <laughs> I'm a clown. Here, laugh at my setup punch bullshit. You know what I mean? Oh, I have a well bullshit. Yeah. I have a well crafted joke. Go fuck yourself. Everybody can craft <laughs> a joke. What is cool is I just I just believe what, in the writing, but yeah. No, no, no. What is woke is to let people know, hey, this is happening in society. Mm. Every bit must say society. Mm. And then they understand. And you have to beat it into them. You have to beat, especially white so comedians people. Comedians change the world, not people who are actually serious about, you know, being an activist and actually marching and petitioning. And it's comedians that are changing the world. Exactly. Because through my voice, nowadays, I'm reaching tens, maybe even hundreds of people sometimes. Huh. Each time. Yeah. So. I think you do seven shows. Yeah. Each show carries what two, three hundred? Yeah. Times seven. Yeah. It's over almost that's almost two thousand people, Plus, man. The pussy be off the chain. You get pussy all the time. For being woke. For being woke. Damn, that's another angle. Never thought about that. That's the main angle. Is, that's the main angle. Is the pussy. Straight all the mad the pussy all coming mad at you. Pussy. Yeah, yeah. And the uh the just though. Yeah. Like, hey. I'm not just a, just a pussy, but yeah. you're like you got to give it up though. I'm woke, and they're but like, but sometimes, right. sometimes you have to take the transgender pussy too, because then you're just you're fucked up if you don't. You gotta you gotta you get have to all take of it. all the pussy. You, know you what gotta I mean? get all of it. Yeah. So yeah. if you don't take the transgender pussy, then you ain't woke. You ain't woke. Exactly. Yeah. And honestly, you could say transgender all you want, but that that's a that's, that's just a, pussy. That's pussy, really. You bottom out a little early, but it's still pussy. You think so? Oh, you don't yeah. think there's. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to see how far I could go, and you're like, "Bitch, I call you bluff." And I was like, Ugh. "Keep going." You Keep don't going. think? <laughs> Damn, that's some willful ignorance for your ass. Uh, willful ignorance: a decision in bad faith to avoid becoming informed about something, so as to avoid having to make undesirable decisions that such information might prompt. 